Java the Hutt slash Boba Fett throne room is starting to ship, and today we're going to talk about our must-have top 10 vintage collection figures for a Java the Hutt setup. All coming up on the next Action Collectibles and More video. What's up everyone? Welcome back to Action Collectibles and More, and today we have a special um, unboxing video and a top 10 list combined. That job is thrown or the Boba Fett thrown, whatever you want to call it, is um, starting to ship. Some people have it on, in the UK already, uh, here in the United States. Um, the ship date is September 1st. Not sure if we're going to get it earlier now. Coming soon, so I'm getting prepared. I got some figures on my last hunt, some Jabba the Hutt thrown figures. Um, so if you want to watch that video, catch it right here. Um, so I'm going to open up some of those figures that I got on the hunt. I have 10 and I'm making it a, um, a top 10 list. So... Basically, I'm going to open up what I feel like is the top 10 figures in the vintage collection needed for a job at the Hut Throne scene. The place that it's shipping, Hasbro's calling it the Boba Fett Throne. I'm calling it Jabba the Hut Throne because that's what I'm using it as. The place that comes with a bit for tuner, vintage collection figure. So I'm not sure why it's not called a bit for tuner place that, but whatever you're calling it, it doesn't matter. It's awesome. Uh, I've seen some good videos on it already. Only one Kenobi just put up a video uh, the other day and looks fantastic. Today I'm going to unbox these awesome 10 figures that I think is needed for a throne room. Before you do that, if you guys are new here, you just kind of, YouTube just showed you this video and you were lucky enough to click on it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, uh, like this video, make sure you're notified for any up-to-date content. Okay, so enough of that. Let's open up some action figures.
Okay, so I'm crazy, but I'm not that crazy. I'm not opening that. I have a loose one here to go in the set. Okay, so here is my top 10 must-have vintage collection figures for a Jabba the Hutt throne setup. So if you're going full-blown vintage collection, these are my top 10 list. There is one honorable mention though, and I'm going to talk about this guy right here. I don't have one to open right now. I'm waiting for a unpunch one to come in. And when that does, I'm going to open up this one. And he would have been on my top 10 list. Probably replacing this guy here. I like the wolf figure better. It's probably one of the better figures in the whole entire line. But I didn't have one to open right now. But I picked up this guy here on my last toy hunt. He is obviously a few of these is a must have, but they are going for some some nice money right now. This Luke Jedi, one of my favorite figures from the line. One of the better, probably my favorite Return of the Jedi Boba Fett. And the three and three quarter line. And then who thought that was gonna open up this figure right here? I'm lucky to have this one loose. I got it a couple years ago before the prices really started to go up on it. But this figure alone, Lewis, is going for crazy money. As is the card one, the unpunch one that I showed you before. It's going for even more, so that would have been crazy if I opened it. And Jackface, face has been reissued, but it's still an amazing figure. Probably don't need this, but I still want that one in the um, scene because I'm going to have him her next to the Carbonite. And these two figures here come in the um, the first uh, playset, the Jabba Hut playset from Walmart, the Walmart exclusive. Uh, so these two figures come with that set. And there's the skinny version of Bib. Still can't believe it comes with no accessories, but really nice figures here. This is our top ten list. I mean, obviously, it's a lot more you could put in that in that um, setup. It doesn't have to be vintage collection. Some good legacy figures or even Power of the Force. Or if you have some old vintage Kenner figures, but I'm going this route. Hopefully I get that set pretty soon. Once I do, I'll stop putting these figures in. All right guys, so I appreciate you watching that video. Um, like I said, that set should be shipping in a couple weeks here in the US. Some people have uh, gotten it in the UK already. Lucky them to get it. Nice uh, present to get, all right, at the, the last month of the summer. Um, so enjoy that. Um, but again, hope you enjoyed the video, and um, like always, go get yourself some action figures.